see this that real motherfucking thing in these right here. What up, hey, that's Danny, it's your girl, Mama Jones, and Mama Jones is about to cook some mustard greens, and I'm going to cook a um, fresh pork loin in roast, and I'm going to make me some jalapeno cheese cornbread. So y'all just stay tuned on, gang. Okay, you guys, this is Mama Jones pork loin roast. I'm going to wash it. Alright, this is the pork line roast. And what I'm going to do, I'm going to do something different. Mama Jones done got hooked on this drunken stuff. So, I'm going to try a drunken roast. You know, I done heard of drunken chicken. I done tried the drunken hen. I done tried the drunken turkey. Now, I'm about to try a drunken roast. And I'm, I'm going to put it in a bag, which this is a bag I bought for Thanksgiving for turkey. Just to try something different. But I'm going to put this roast in there. Let, well, let me see if I'm going to cook a drunken roast first. Hold on. Oh, yes. Mama Jones is going to cook a drunken roast. All right. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to season this roast. Alright. Give me a little black pepper. I'm not going to stuff it. I don't feel like doing all that junk the other day. So, we're going to put that in there. Uh, put a little pepper, Rick. Wait, oh Lord, I done put the wrong thing. I done put a dash of cumin where the wrong one. What is the base? Oh. Anyway, it ain't gonna hurt it. Mama Jones, do experiment, you guys. That's how I come up with different dishes, but. I'm gonna try this. We got to see how this here gonna taste. I'm gonna put a little parsley. Okay. Then I'm gonna put on. Um, let's see. Uh, do I want to put it to smoke it? No, I'm not gonna do a smoky flavor to it today. I'm just gonna do. We just gonna hit it with some garlic pepper. All right, and that's it. That's the only thing I'm putting in there today. I don't want to put all this stuff in there. And I will put one, one um, cube, one broth cube because I'm not um, cutting up any bear pepper or none of that in there today. Because Mom Jones is being lazy. That dog on baby shower had wore me out. I had been on the go all week. So I just slept all day yesterday. So I'm going to put the cube in the bag. I need uh, my hands. And I'm going to rub everything in here. That's good enough for me. We're gonna put it in the bag. Oh, now we open this. Can you see what Mama Jones is doing? Mama Jones finna pull this beer. Let me see, can y'all see? Cause my camera ain't. On. Light right. All right. Let me wash my hands. All right. Mom Jones is about to pull this spear, this bud light, into this bag. Now. I'm 
tied up in a knot. The oven is on. Check it out. I'm going to place it in one of my old faithfuls. And I'm going to put it in the oven. So y'all stay tuned. And I'll be back. Okay, you guys. I'm back. And I'm going to make some Jeffrey cornbread. Because I like Jiffy. I know how to make it from scratch. But. I don't. So. We like sweet cornbread. And I don't know. I just rather Jiffy. Because it don't take me as long. To do it. Right. And this cornbread here, I learned from a friend. And I tried it, and it was good, so guess what? Tom Jones cooks it every now and then. I makes this jalapeno cheese cornbread. So, I know yeah, some of y'all are going to be like, ooh, who does that? Ooh. Who makes jalapeno cheese cornbread? Mama Jones. Y'all see what I'm doing? All right. Mama Jones don't feel like cooking, but I'm gonna cook today. I got to bring you guys something, huh? Ain't that right? Yep. So, I'm gonna get it together. My grandkids eat this too, you guys. So you know it have peppers. I got one that love to eat peppers. We have to tell him he can't eat them like that by themselves. But I made this for him. And he fell in love with it. All right. Let me get the cheese. Parmesan cheese. I thought I had some other cheese too. Well, I normally use uh, 
like a cheddar cheese, but I'm going to add Parmesan since I got so much of that. And I'm going to add some sliced cheese. I'm going to use some sliced cheese that I'm going to put in there. And sliced cheddar cheese. And I'm just going to break it up. Put it in there. This is going to melt anyway. As y'all know, Mama Jones don't really measure nothing. I eyeball and keep it pushing. And that should be enough cheese. And it's not broke. Nope. Enough for me. Looks like I need to add a little tap more um, milk. Just a little tad of milk. That's not enough. cooking all in the oven. Alright. I'm cooking all in the oven so this is ready to be pulled up. This is how it's going to look in the pan. I'm going to run it on in the oven. I'll be back with you guys when that's ready. I'm about to put the mustard greens on. Stay tuned. Mama Jones, the only thing she adding in her greens today is some of that pork. So I'm not adding in no smoked neck bones, no ham hops, none of that today. Um, I'm just going to cut this up and... I'm going to add this because I only have three bunches of greens and this here might be too much but I love to eat the meat out of the greens anyway so that's all I'm doing today I'm nothing fancy y'all can see it ain't nothing fancy I ain't putting no seasoning on that rope I just gonna let it cook um down into the beer and the little seasoning that I did put on. But each is on. If you want to, you can add onion, bell pepper, garlic, and all that. I'm just not doing it today. Um, Mom Jones just not doing it today. Mom Jones ain't doing it. So, y'all stay tuned. I'll be back and show y'all what I'm about to do. Okay, you guys. Let's bring it a little bit closer. Alright. Y'all see Mama Jones pulled out one old faithfuls. One of my old faithful pots. Yes, I have. 
And this pot I have a little dash of cooking oil just to saute my um, putting onion in here. So, yeah, Mom Jones, it's cold. It's cold outside. I'm cold. I'm just ready to get in my bed and watch ID channel. All right. So we just cutting this up. Then I'm going to add the parcel. And I'm about to add some garlic. A lot of people don't put onion and stuff in their greens, but I do. Not all the time, but I do it the majority of the time. The main thing that I make sure I put in my greens are is a piece of bell pepper. And that's just something my mom used to do. Or whatever. And I'm going to take it. You don't do a whole bell pepper. You do. Piece of bell pepper. Sometimes I cut them up, sometimes I don't. But today, I'm just going to chop it up because I'm chasing. Cut anyway. And then, put my greens in here and clean my kitchen back up. And I'm done. And I'll be back and show y'all my finishing results. Yes. Don't be the this fast. This, this late the right here today. For real. Mom Jones ain't playing. Not today. I'm cold. Oh. And then them little greens ain't gonna cook down the much enough. But I really want to see how this drunken, um, how this drunken roast don't taste. So my girls really want to see. Then I'm, then I'm trying to hurry up you guys so before Peyton wake up. Because I did have hair this morning. Um, I'm going to post a little blog on this. Because Mom don't have many talents. So, I'm just trying to see. What I'm doing. Yeah, but I've been up this morning. I done did crochet braid. And now I'm cooking. I would just run that log together. I don't know. I might, I might not. I already had prepped and washed my greens and picked them. Prep, wash the greens and pick the greens. Um, I was going to cook some greens with y'all uh, with some smothered pork chops and rice and gravy with the mustard greens on the side. That's what I was going to cook. Look how that's looking, you guys. Can you see? 
Looking real good. About to add these uh, greens to this pot. We got a little water from it, but I'm just going to add a little bit and add my little seasoning, my little pinch of sugar. I'm going to do two pinches. Add my liquid smoke. Smoke. All right. Um, today I normally use regular vinegar, but today I'm using my apple cider. Using my apple cider vinegar today, and I'm doing two capsules. One. Two capsules of apple cider and I'm going to add one of my seasoning cubes. Add a seasoning cube and I normally use beef flavor. Today I'm adding chicken flavor. It don't matter because if you know how to cook, your food gonna be good anyway. It's just a lot of people like, oh, can't cook with this, or you need this, you need that. No, you don't. All you need is a taste bud. Get that taste you want, you good to go. Little pep. And I'm putting a little um Tony's. That's it. That's all thing I'm putting in here today. And I'm going to let it roll with the roll roll. Alright you guys, stay tuned. I'm put my top on it. Turn it down some and let it slow roll it. Stay tuned. Look One, them little bunch of greens cooked down and up. And look like when I cook a little bit, everybody going to want to come eat. Look at that. Don't make no sense to cook a lot. Everybody be gone. So then the taste gonna be just right. I don't know. I might see do I got some in there I can add to it in the can. Just to stretch it a little because I gotta feel me. I'm gonna have to they gonna be made. And they come here looking for them green. Ooh. Yep, I need to add a little more seasoning. Oh, oh, oh. Nope, I don't have any, so. Oh, wait. Well. Let's see. Nope. Mama Jones don't have no, um, no more. No more. No. I ain't worried about it. So. Um, John ain't worried about that. I had a little more seasoning though, because it needs some. And that's it right there. And let it just cook on down. Cook them on super low because it ain't that many. It ain't going to take them long to get done. Oh, yes. That cornbread beginning to look right. Stay tuned. Okay, you guys. In this pot, I got some uh, 
this cooking oil. I discovered that I'm gonna need to cook something else because I thought about it. Them greens is not enough. I could eat that by myself. So just to stretch it, I'm gonna do a box dirty rice. I don't normally I use it, but I cook it a whole total different way. Um I normally like to mix it with um a dirty rice with a jambalaya and this other stuff that I normally put in it that I'm not gonna do today. I'll show y'all that on another video when I get ready to do cookout and stuff like that. I'll show y'all or whenever I cook it again, I'll show y'all what I do to my zatarain. I know how to make it from scratch. I just choose the easy way. And I'm gonna show y'all when I make it, you know, from scratch. But this is a simple way. This is one of the way I do it, but it's other stuff that I add to it. And you'll be like, dang. But here, I done cut up a little celery and green onion so far. And I'm just gonna let that, uh, that's so okay. I never cooked in a pot, I never cooked jambalaya with dirty rice in a pot this small. But I'm also trying to learn how to cook a little. Because I cook too much and my kids they don't stay here so I be sending food all around the corner, down the street and everywhere. So I won't have to Get rid of it. Throw it away. Okay. And I'm gonna do the garlic. I'm gonna add that onion. And I'm gonna add some garlic. And a piece of bell pepper. I'm going to show you guys what I do to it the other way I cook it. And nobody can't figure out what I do to it. But when I cook it for y'all, just don't give my little secrets away. I'm trying to finish all this before Peyton get up. She done tore up my house already while I was doing hair. So, when she get up, she gonna be hollering, ee, 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 momo, ee, ee. So it should be ready by the time she uh, get up. And it shouldn't take that roast that long to cook because it's in a bag. So it should get tender pretty quick. Oh, shucks, that needs to be cooked. All right. Now, as that's cooking, I'm gonna chop up my smoke sausage. So, let me cut the light on. Chop up my smoke flashes. And I'm just sampling them this chap it up. This is manly smoke sausage and garlic. No, manly smoke, yeah, green onion, not garlic. And I'm cutting it with the wrong knife because it's just tan up. This is one of my little favorite knives, so everybody that cooks or whatever, you have your certain utensils that you like to use. And me, this one of them. This little Dollar Tree knife. Oh, let's check on this cone bread. Cone bread of Mama Jones about to burn it up. 
And ooh, let's see. And here's the jalapeno cornbread, you guys. It's jalapeno cheese cornbread. Have jalapeno peppers and cheese. The next batch you got Parmesan cheese and regular American cheese in there. And they be good too. You tried, I bet you didn't say Mom Mama Jones is good. It's alright. You know, it tastes okay. It's different. You know, I get tired of cooking the same thing over and over again. So, y'all may see me cook a lot of stuff that y'all cook. But I will cook it different kinds of ways. So. Like this here. Jambalaya, dirty rice. I normally cook that a whole different way. I have, uh, I have a cooker jambalaya and I haven't cooked a jambalaya by itself, just regular jambalaya. It's so long because I mix it, mix it together with, I mix a jambalaya and a dirty rice together. But I add other stuff. I'm not going to tell you what I add because you'll see it when I do a video on it. But that's what I do. And I'm going to let them, I'm waiting on them onions. Let them onion and bell pepper and all that get a little tender. Then I'm going to add the box. So, I'm really trying to learn how to cook a Tell you what, it smells good in here. How it's supposed to smell. Winter time, like you used to walk in your grandma's house or your mama house and they cooking. Yes, honey. That's how I smell of it. Sometimes I have people come knock on my door with your cooking. Smell it down the street. I knew it was you cooking. Yes, honey. I ain't saying I'm the best because I'm not, but I know my stuff. Wait till I get to doing them experiment meals on y'all. Yes, huh? Mama Jones. Nobody better not get on that thing. Tell me how many times she gonna say Mama Jones. Look, bad enough I'm talking to a dog on camera. Oh yes, honey, them greens gonna look good on here. Oh, and normally I have a. Uh, oh, I bet you these greens gonna be so bomb because it ain't but a little bit. Dang it. Normally I have me a can of Glory or Margaret Holmes or something in the cabinet and I could have added to it just to stretch it out a little bit. Because Mama Jones knows how to stretch me a baby. Bet you I could feed a, I could feed a family off of a pot of rice and one chicken. And I can feed about 10 people. Any other time I would have. I don't, and I ain't tripping. Check it out. Come on. This little kiss me rain pot right here. Mm -mm. 
on the, I had a set of Paula Dean pots. I bought every, I bought the pot set and everything she sold on that aisle. I ain't lying. Them pots lasted me a long time, though. They was high, but they lasted. And they did pretty good. And they was nice size pots. These by him. So little. But that's a good thing. It's gonna help me do what I need to do. And Mom Joe gonna keep her old faithful pots. I need them in my life. I haven't had them pots over 20 something years. Check it out. You see that? I need to hurry up for Steve come on. Four o'clock. Yes, honey. Yes, honey, yes. Ooh, I can smell the aroma of that beer. Ooh. Yeah, it's cooking. It's getting right. Oh, it's getting right. Oh, yeah. A drunken Pope Swan Rose. Yes, baby. All right, I just need that celery. Let me taste this celery. Let's see if it's about right. That's almost good. I don't like the crunch on no seasoning at all. It depends on what I'm doing. Like sometimes I like to taste it in my potato salad. The onion, only onion though. Look at that. Yes, honey. I'm gonna tell y'all again, I'm gonna measure much of nothing. Only sweet. Y'all know what I can't cook? Mama Jones can't cook sweet. Some stuff I can get right, but I think I'm too impatient for that. Well, they did teach me how to make the ooey gooey cake. Now I make all kind of ooey gooey cake. Strawberry ooey gooey cake. Lemon ooey gooey cake. All kind of ooey gooey cakes. I made so many ooey gooey cakes I woke myself out on them. Let's see. Yep, now let that just roll. Like let me taste. And I am being late today. Hip. I really am. Hip, hip, freak I'm putting in there. And a little parsley. Just to bring out the little color. Because I don't feel like cooking. I know y'all say she say that one more time. She don't feel like cooking. We just gonna let this cook on. Let me measure it. Oh, let me put a little bit more water. Look, I don't like it. It's too dried up. I really don't like the dry dry. So I'm gonna let that roll to a ball. And once it get the roll into a little rolling ball, I'm gonna turn it down and put the top on. Let's check out this. I'm gonna finish check out this uh roast and see if I'm ready to take it out the bag. Stay tuned. All right, you guys. I wasn't ready to take it out the bag, but 
Unfortunately, I bust the bag. Pulling it out the oven. So, now I got to get it up there. And just let it cook in the beer. And it's hot. Let the beer roll on in the pan. Taste a piece of the top. Let me see. Is that flavor how I want? Let me fit in. I'm gonna put the top on and run it right on back in the oven. Mmm. 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 I oughta cut it up. What y'all think? Cut it up? Yeah. Make it cook a little fast. Nah, I'm just gonna slice it. And flip it over. That's what I'm gonna do. Slice it, flip it over, and put the top on. Like bland food I'm sorry that's not me now I got to have some kind of taste to my food and that's just the way I was raised up by no country folks all right I'm gonna flip it over and cut them a little bit more and I'm gonna let that be up Cook in it and just come basing every now and then. So it get tender. I could really eat this here by myself. I really could. Once it get tender, baby, you can pull that meat on off there or you know, however. Let it slow roll it. Just slow roll it in that oven with that beer. What I'm gonna do is take a piece of butter and just slide it on in that milk. Give it a garlic bread. And I'm gonna sprinkle a little more garlic pepper. Oh no. Where is it? I moved it. Alright. Okay. Well, well, 
I think I put it in the wrong spot. It's my bad there. Mm hmm I did. I thought I did. Mm -hmm. Oh, in my face. In your face. So it's going to let that roll. Let me hold this up. And I'm just going to come back and do the basic. Let them juices get in. Flip it every now and then until it get done. Until it get ready. And it up on the oven. And I'm about to turn it up because I ain't got time. I'm home. Alright, check this out you guys. It's ready for me to turn this down. We'll turn it to like three. Three. Yeah. And then I'm going to put the top on. And let it do its thing. I ain't never made a pot of dirty rice that small. So, y'all stay tuned. Mama Jones will be back when that ropes is ready, baby. Oh, them greens, yeah, they come together too. Y'all stay tuned. Alright, head ass gang. <laughs> that dirty rice is ready. And as you see, it's not stiff. I don't like it stiff. I don't like it too dried out. So, y'all just stay tuned. Alright, head ass gang. Mom Jones is back. Mom Jones is about to flip this roast again. It be a batter. Yes, about to flip it again. Now I'm gonna base it again. Let it roll. It's getting right. It's getting right. Oh yeah, it tastes right. That juice too. All right, you guys, stay tuned. I think I'm going to cut it up to make it cook a little bit faster. Stay tuned on gang. All right, you guys, I'm cutting it up. As you can see, and I think I'm going to pour another beer in it. Papa John, going to be mad. He's going to come on looking for his, his bud like after a hard day work. And I don't cook with it. Cutting it up. Oh, yeah. Man, this is so not just walking. Cut it up, and I'm gonna add. I'm gonna add another beer. Now 
flavor is already there. The flavor straight. I'm just adding another bill. So we can just go on cooking it, cook on down and get tender. Alright you guys, stay tuned and I'll be back with the ending results of this drunken pork lawn roast. Yes, stay tuned. Alright, head ass gang. Here's the jalapeno cheese cornbread. Jalapeno cheese, cornbread, and greens. Check it out. Mom Jones about to get her grub on. Don't yeah, forget. To, gang, thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up and that subscribe button on yeah. Gang. Head ass, gang, gang, head ass, gang, gang, head ass, gang, gang, head ass, gang, gang, on that, on that head ass, gang, peanut butter head ass, biscuit head ass, sausage head ass,